Anderson here again, and today we're talking about granite sinks. Now, granite sinks are very popular, and for very good reason. They look fantastic in your kitchen, but there are a few things you should consider when you're going for a granite sink, as it's not always the best option for your kitchen. So, some of the downsides of a granite sink. Firstly, they take more care and maintenance. You need to just be a little bit more careful. The advantage of stainless steel sinks is that they're almost bomb proof, where if you chip your granite sink, there's no real going back on that. They are very sturdy, being made up of 80% quartz and 20% resin. They're formed by mixing up that solution and then putting it into a mold. Hence, you're limited a little on how many sizes and dimensions you can get because they all require being poured into a mold to form. Uh, they're very, very similar to your engineered stone bench top. Now, some differences between the different colors. So we've got black, gray and white available at Icon Commercial. Now, black is probably our most popular color. However, you need to keep in mind that if you have a high calcium content in your water, you are more prone to get a calcium ring appearing around your waist with a black granite quartz sink. Uh, it can be combated very easily, you just need to clean your sink more, and as someone that may be, according to my fiance, is a little lazy, a granite composite sink might not be the best for me, where if you are more productive in cleaning, then a granite composite should be no problem at all. Also, care and maintenance, I highly recommend that you base your sink, much like you would base your cast iron frying pan, with a little bit of olive oil or just cooking oil in general. It seals your sink a little bit more and makes it so you don't have to clean it as often. Also with the white sinks you need to be careful because they are a bit more prone to being marked. So much like a white car you can see a little mark on it a lot easier. Same with a white sink. Still beautiful gorgeous sinks very popular. The grey is probably the least vulnerable to marking or showing any kind of stains, but other than that, fantastic sink, can't go wrong. One cleaning tip for your white sinks that I shouldn't forget before I go, is that if you do end up with some coffee stains or a bit of a black scuff on your sink, one way to remove some stains from your white granite composite sinks is using a bleach formula of one parts bleach to three parts water. Let it rest in your sink for a little while and that should help remove any stains and marks that you might get in your white composite sink. 